Yeah, buddy. Some work's been done. I got my uh, 8032 uh, Summit uh, bracket, throttle bracket on here. I guess you could say detent throttle bracket on here. It looks okay. Um, it's not a 100% perfect fit. You can see some of the stuff doesn't line up quite right 100%, but it's a heck of a lot better than what it was. And I went and bought me some Excel wires, splurged a little bit, got me some better wires on here and some wire looms so that that stuff would quit getting on the header. And uh, some of the header bolts were loose, had an exhaust leak, got that tightened up. Truck runs pretty good. Uh, also got me another transmission dipstick, which is supposed to be the proper one as far as the depth that it goes into the pan. Seems I was like quart and a half low from the 704 dipstick that the people, the dipsticks that done the work, um, took the 704 dipstick and put it in here, and that's the reason why they wouldn't go all the way in the tranny, trans uh, dipstick hole, right? And it was giving me an incorrect fluid reading. So about a quart and a half to almost two quarts low of transmission fluid. Um, but uh, anyway, truck seems to be running pretty good. Uh, got some front end work I need to do. Some of y'all could tell from the ride alongs that uh, seems like I'm running uh, in NASCAR because it looks like I'm just making a constant left hand turn. Uh, does need a front end alignment and it does need uh, probably ball joints and uh, outer tie rod ends and probably a pitman arm. But uh, other than doing that and uh, putting, probably going to order some new coil springs for it and just do all that at one time, the upper and lower ball joints, coil springs, pitman arm and all that stuff. And the Belltech uh, leaf springs that I found that would actually um, lift the truck up in the back about an inch and uh, make it a little stiffer back there to where I'm not feeling every bump and the truck will ride better. Uh, both the springs is going to cost me about 300 something dollars, a little over 300 bucks. But anyway, that's a future project. We just kind of wanted to show a little progress on the truck. I'm kind of I'm, I'm a little bit happy with the, the bracket. It looks a lot cleaner. It looks like it a lot better than what the other one looked like with zip ties and stuff on it but uh, anyway this is a, another boring edition of Paul Block's Garage and uh, when more work gets done or I decide to go do a, a ride along or drive along I'll take you with me if you would give a thumbs up if you liked the video a thumbs down if you hated it and uh, if I helped you out any or helped you make a decision on a part you may be looking or a future project you may be looking at your 88 through 94 OBS or in my case uh, no OBS, it's HEI. I don't even have a computer in here anymore, but did have the TBI in it, OBS. But anyway, um, y'all have a good day, and peace out.